Morning in Namuongo, a suburb of Kampala, as enumerators set out to start this year's national housing and population census. One by one, they recorded as residents answered questions from the booklet, a process that takes on average about 40 minutes. They have been nice and they have been cooperating, cooperative. So like one of them was like, I was waiting for, I was waiting to be counted. The first family was counted by Ben Paul Mungereza, the executive director, Uganda Bureau of Statistics, at State House, Nakasero. They answered all the questions that I needed for the census. And as the exercise peaked in most parts of the city, a heavy downpour that lasted for about two hours briefly halted the pace. It had to be stopped in some places, as most people were indoors and the enumerators could not move. But they say the exercise has been going on well and most of them had met the target they were set of close to 15 people a day. It's a raining when I had done 13 by, by 3 o'clock. But in some places it was all about the questions being asked by the enumerators. Do I have salt? Do I have sugar? Do I use soap? Someone says, I live in Kampala. You, you should ask such stupid questions to people who live in the villages. The Uganda Bureau of Statistics say there were no major problems except delays especially with the border communities. There is a controversy as to who enumerates which um, uh, parish or village, but all these are being handled together with the local uh, leaders. Uganda's confirmed population stood at 24 million as per the last census in 2002, though it is currently estimated at about 35 million. The first census was conducted in 1911 under British colonial rule. Moses Sakena, NTV.